So we would like to start now. Can you hear me? Yes. Thank you very much for coming. We're very happy. Uh, many of you had a long travel and maybe a jet lag. We are happy to host INSEA at the University of Applied Arts in Vienna. My name is Ruth Matthäus Bär. I am professor at the University of Applied Arts in Vienna, chairwoman of the Senate, and also working at the Institute for Art Education and that uh, we are in a cooperation team. So uh, actually this conference was organized by DART and many, many other people. The University of Applied Arts in Vienna is one of the leading art schools of the world um, and was founded in um, 1867. And we are in times of reconstruction, so we will go afterwards, we will have a lot of lectures in the main building. Um, and uh, we, but we still wanted to host the conference here, though we are constructing our buildings. And um, I want to um, say hello and welcome very much um, our the presidents, the boards from INSEA, not just the present, but present presidents, but also uh, former presidents as Charlotte Strobele. Um, and I want to thank all the scientific committee, committee for helping us um, making difficult uh, decisions in what kind of papers are taken or not. It was triple blind peer reviewed, so all of you uh, can be sure that it was a very transparent form. We also want to um, welcome um, all our professors, um, collaborated, uh, collaborators at our university or colleagues. Yes, so um, maybe most important, Luise um, Reitstetter and me, we will give you a short introduction about what will happen, what has happened and what will happen today. Mm -hmm. And maybe to give you an overview. Um, this is the statistics. So we are about, uh, we have about 40 nationalities in these rooms at the moment. I think that's great. We are very international. <laughs> Thanks for coming. We have a very tense program. So also interesting concerning art education. Um, this is uh, the gender statistics. Oh, the gender statistics. <laughs> we will have five keynotes. Uh, thank you all keynote speakers to come and make their way to Vienna. We have 95 lectures. Thank you all for giving in your papers. And we will have 21 workshops during this time. I think my name is Louise, I'm part of the organizing committee and first I want to really guide you through these three days because I think it's dense, it also might be sometimes complicated to understand all our program stuff, but first of all I think you all know Clelia Zivkovic and that she should come on stage because you all corresponded with her and she did a great job. <laughs> so. So we three are the organizing committee, um, and now just, just really I do the basics. Um, here we are right now at the RIL, this is the Angewandte Innovation Lab, but later on most of us will go to the, ma to the main building to we call like, here it's called um, University of Applied Arts Vienna, and if you can hear short, we always call it also Angewandte. So you can see it on the map. Um, but just to make it that you know where to find what, here we have got the registration that most of you already did, an info point. We've got here the keynotes, the workshops. There's, on top there's the workshop floor, just written IEL. And if you go down the, st the stairs, it's IEL minus one. Um, here we also have got tonight a very nice welcome reception with our rector, Mr. Bast. At Oskar Kokoschka Platz, it's not less important as we've got the, the, the biggest program is there because all the lecture sessions are taking place there. And the in, there's an info desk as well, so please always address our info, uh, nice information persons. And there's also a bookshop, and I think very important also, there is the buffet. Here you can get coffee, but really if you want to eat something properly, we, we really arrange something nice, so go to Oskar Kokoschka Platz, to the Angewandte. 
So these are really basic needs, drink, eat, but also sleep. We have got a very nice conference hotel cooperation partner, which is Magdritz, it's a social enterprise. They're dealing with immigrants um, that can work there already. And I think you probably checked in and you will meet a lot of people from there as we have booked a really huge contingent of rooms there. Um, if it's getting, also if I stick to eating, then t tomorrow night we have got the dinner, and this is really on top of our plan, the conference dinner. As it is quite complicated to get there, please now be, be aware and give us your attention. There's a shuttle bus. It's not written in the program, but tomorrow night after the lecture of Michael Hahn, who is already here, we will have a shuttle bus at 18.30. We all meet here and then we go to our shuttle bus that takes us there all the ones that registered. Unfortunately, we are booked out. Um, then on, then we've got what you also can see are these, like, these five museums on top. Um, they are all very well, easily to reach, and there are these metro subway stations close to them. You see U1, U3, U4, you will find them. The meeting point is in the museums. Um, now I'll walk you through the program. We are already at the welcome note. Afterwards, we are happy to have our executives of INSEA speaking and in welcoming you. And then we start with the first and opening keynote of Pascal Gielen. Afterwards, there's just a short break of 30 minutes. And then we already start with the lecture sessions. So there, I think it would say, you will need five minutes to go to Oscar, to Adria Angewandte. So take your time to go there. And then there we have got five parallel lecture, lecture sessions. And here we have got, here at the IL on top and down, we have got two parallel workshop sessions. We continue with this program, and in the evening it's as well, we come, we unite here again. There will be the opening address of our rector, the keynote of Jocelyn Dodd, and another keynote of Carmen Mersch, followed by a short discussion, and then we've got a welcome reception with drinks and snacks. On Friday, we, we start early for some. We start early with the ones that go to school. We've got a school tour bus, to a, a school tour bus and um, it was really, I think you really liked our program that much. We were overbooked um, since, I would say, in hours. So we organized a second tour. You can all go that registered. And the meeting point is again here at 9 o'clock. Stephanie Pekritz, who, who also programmed the tours and gui will guide one of the tours. The other one will guide Ruth. Um, she will give a short introduction, introduction and then we go by bus. But for the ones who could not get a seat in our bus tour, we have got a very special program. We've got a nude drawing. So Maria Demnitschka, who also um, that is a teacher of nude drawing at our university, she will do a special class for you. And this class is for beginners as well as for advanced person. Just go, sign up, it's there as well, and just go there. The, everything is organized. Again, then we start with the parallel sessions. And at night, we come again to the IL, where there will be the keynotes of Leslie Ann Noel and Michael Hahn, and then the bus to the dinner. On Saturday, it's kind of a more relaxed program. We decided to go for that. Um, we have got a really beautiful museum program that you also already also liked a lot. We've got huge um, registrations for that. There will be three in the morning, two in the afternoon. Just go to the museums. And there will be also two um, urban exploration tours. One is very experimental that just only some people could, could sign up. It's with students from our social design department. But if, you wanted, if you're for the first time in Vienna, there's also a nice option with a good, a very good, good tour guide and you will meet here at one and you get, could get a classic sightseeing tour to get to know Vienna. There are, still places. there are still places. Just go to the information desk and then you get your seat. Yes, um, just this is my little last remark. Our conference is called Art and Design in Times of Change. We have also got, we could add an S. We've got also some side conference changes as we are really a huge conference but all these little changes will always be communicated at the information <coughs> desk so just always head there if you need some info yeah yes it's uh, uh, actually uh, such a big conference i must say it's uh, actually the i would say uh, the first or the biggest open call conference our institution is hosting. We didn't make any open call conferences that far in that way. We did one last year and it's actually four or five times as big as last year. 
And you must imagine that for such a university um, and everybody is working in our team really to make you feel comfortable and it's our kind of our first time to do something like that. So please excuse um, if we make any mistakes. If there is something to criticize, please criticize me because I'm the main responsible. And please don't criticize um, um, my fabulous team because um, without this team I couldn't do this conference. Yes. So thank you, Clelia. Thank you, Luise. And there are much more. Uh, we collaborated uh, within this conference very much with the event management of the Angewandte, Jasmin Vogel. Um, as our university um, is parallel working, um, uh, she is right now at the moment at a um, contemporary fair, so she cannot be here, but actually um, I think it was a very great collaboration and we must note that without her as well and her team it's not possible. But please see now here, I want to thank all those people standing here. We hope we did not forget anybody. So I will just shortly um, name them. Um, they, they are helpers, they are helping hands, you will find them. Many of them are our students from our institutions. We will have also something like conference interruptions, this is a surprise. So we uh, thank very much also Uldus A. Marze, Anita Bauer, Franz Pilmeier, Karl Peter Puschkehüle, Eric Bohemia, Alison Clark, Glenn Kutz, Alexander Damianisch, Helmut Draxler, Claudia Egartner, Brigitte Felderer, Susanna Flock, Arnold Gallhuber, Markus Gebhardt, Michel Gölt, Alexandra Graupner, Peter Gregory, Michael Hahn, Valentina Hirsch, Miriam Hübel, Marie Huth, Pilerin Jaik, Beatrice Jaschke, Janine Jesch, Stefanie Kaiser, Fares Kajali, Eva Kernbauer, Elke Krasny, Milena Korteczek, Philipp Köster, Hanna Krisanova, Michael Lechner, Beate Lex, Alejandra Loreto, Virginia Louis, Julia Makoschitz, Pia Meyer, Peter Osolani, Sascha Osaka, Marina Patela Niemen, Laura Palden, Stefanie Pegritz, Silke Pfeiffer, Sarah Potfelsk, Barbara Putzblecko, Mili Reed, Gerhard Rösner, Michael Lechner, Luise Reitstetter, Philipp Röttl, Nadja Schreier, Monika Sommer, Eva-Maria Stadler, Pia Schaler, Alessia Sküderi, Lenia lieders Hemlitsch, Arturo Silva, Eva-Maria Sommer, Maren Staatsacher, Maria Temnitschka, Isabel Termini, Enrico Tomasini, Teresa Torres de Ecker, Kechi Trink, Jasmin Vogel, Reinhard Wesseli, Janneke Wink, Nico Wind, Julia Wohlfahrt, Ernst Wagner, Josia Sabielska, Michael Zietner, Klila Sivkovic, Andrea Zotti. Please, much more. Um, and, yes, sorry, we have two, actually two papers, so I, um, I actually edited it. Um, uh, special thanks also for Christoph Kaltenbrunner who helped us. You will have a surprise, those of you who go to the conference dinner. And he helped us also very much in the organization. Thank you very much. So thank you, Christoph. Thank you, everybody. Um, such a conference is just possible with such a team. Thank you, all my team. We're looking for a highly interesting conference and wish us good vibes. And now I want to hand in um, the microphone to Insea. Thank you very much, Teresa. Uh, where is Teresa? Ah, here. Um, so please, I would like to ask the Insea board on stage. Thank you very much, Ruth. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this wonderful Congress, which is really a big F4FT small team, uh, led by Ruth and Louise, and these marvelous people in Vienna who made it possible for us, INSEA members from all around the world, to come here and uh, to make this encounter possible. So thank you very much for the Viennese team. And I wish to thank you, all of you who had come to Vienna to meet and to talk about what we are doing in art education, about our hopes, about our problems, about how to overcome our problems, and also about friendship, because INSEA is about friendship. And um, sorry, just uh, found it. 
I need the image, I'm sorry, but we are visual art teachers and it's a bit odd not having image with us. And <laughs> I want to reach all the Austrian art teachers and researchers and artists who made art education so strong in our times. And since the topic of the conference is changing times, I wish to remember that people like Franz Sizek, like Charlotte Stobelli, Angelica Plant, uh, were very important in making this education through art possible in the world. So our deepest thanks, especially to Charlotte, who is here today. Thank you so much for being here because the most of you are born after we made the first Congress of INSEA in Baden by Wien. At least I think when I was looking around, you are very young and this is a hope for the future because I'm almost 100 years old. You know. <laughs> so, the world is changing and on one hand I'm glad that it's changing. On the other hand, it's up to you how it will change this world. And especially when we have the most people of whole Europe, because Europe, what is Europe? This is also a question we have to talk about it now with all the people they are coming from all different parts, especially from the Near East. So I'm glad that you are here to thank especially Ruth, that she invited me and that you have the opportunity to make plans for the future. Thank you. Thank you very much, Charlotte. Charlotte, Charlotte Strobele was not only an art teacher for 10 years, she was my art teacher in school. Besides, she did a PhD at Reinhardt Seminar. Besides, she was teaching at the Academy of Fine Arts. And then she founded one of the biggest land art festivals of Europe, the Arte Sella, which will be 30 years old, or have birthday of 30 years. So this is Charlotte Strobele. So let's keep this in mind. With our history and with our pioneers, we'll, we'll make the future. And thank you very much for all behind us, like Charlotte and Angelic and many others. Yosi Proca, who just passed away last week. And uh, Stuart also, Stuart McDonald. They are in our hearts and they make us stronger to make art education possible in our these difficult times. So uh, the, the main idea of this conference is really dialogue, isn't it, Truth and Luis? So I hope our dialogues will make this encounter unforgettable, that we, in 10, 20 years, will remember as we remember now Baden in the 80s. So let's make these two days something very special with all of you. And now I will ask Rita to continue to talk about INSEA. So it truly is wonderful to be here with the Viennese hospitality and to see the European community. So my role today is just to give you a, 
uh, reminder about the International Journal of Education through Art. It feels a little awkward because Glenn is still the principal editor and um, I've had the um, privilege of working with him over the last year of watching everything he does and I have to say my hat's off to him and his, his team because they've done a superlative job and I really valued his mentorship. So thank you for everything you've done. His, um, here's uh, volume 12, number two, but I, I can say that volume 12, number three, his last issue, has, uh, has just gone online. It's unfortunate we can't show it to you here, but if you look online, it actually is online, and the hard copy will be out very shortly. For those of you who may not get hard copies any longer, they are available to members for 50% off if you want to um, order a hard copy. Um, so my other, uh, another member of my editorial team is Anita Sinner, who's just here handing out some postcards and some, uh, some um, business cards. And I would just like to encourage people in this audience to think about submitting to the, to the International Journal of Education through Art. It has a very high standing in the field. Uh, we're very proud of what's been ha what has the, the achievement we've made over the last dozen years. Hats off to Rachel Mason and Glenn Coots for shepherding it to this stage. So we hope that it will continue having a very international authorship and readership. And I look forward to receiving not only your articles, but visual essays for the journal. And the only other thing I might mention in my role on INSEA is just to have, be the liaison for the World Alliance for Arts Education. And just to remind you that this inter, interdisciplinary international group is meeting in uh, Huangzhou, China in early December. Uh, INSEA is very proud that Ernst Wagner is going to be one of our keynote speakers speaking on education and sustainability. It's also going to be a very fine conference. So just that you know, in, this, in that venue, we have art, music, drama, and dance educators from around the world coming together. So that's also another occasion in case you're interested in participating in some of our activities. So again, thank you, and I look forward to really enjoying your city. And who's next? Thanks, Rita. I'm Jim Sanders. I'm the treasurer and membership coordinator for INSEA. So I um, am happy to tr communicate with you and to share information about how one can become a member. It's basically go to insea.org and you'll find on the website in the upper right hand corner a little button that says join renew and we'll process your subscription. Uh, we are using PayPal because it's uh, recognized and used in more countries than any other uh, facility. I, I just warn you, always just trash anything you receive from them because it's junk. Um, but you don't have to be a subscriber to PayPal to process those. So as long as you have a bank debit or credit card, it's fairly easy. My main role today is to announce and to welcome you to the 2017 World Congress that will be in um, Korea next year in, I believe it's August, and uh, we certainly hope you'll make that long flight from here and come visit and have a chance to learn about the Korean art education scene as well as what your colleagues internationally are doing. And so I'm not sure who I turn this over to. I think it's Glenn. But um, again, I will be around. We are also working currently on trying to develop alternate forms of membership processing that uh, may be able to be done by wire in uh, Europe. Uh, but again, these are things that uh, Teresa and I are more than happy to work through. And thank you for being here. Good day. <clears throat> uh, thank you, Jim. My name is Glenn Coots, and I'm uh, Vice President at the moment. And Teresa asked me to say a few words about another dimension of NCA's work, that of awards. Um, traditionally, we have had three awards to recognise individuals who have made outstanding contributions to the field. The Reed, Herbert Reed Award, Ziegfeld Award, and El Bacioni Award. 
And, and so these, these awards are uh, available each year, and NCM members can nominate in individuals that they think have made uh, outstanding contributions. But there are another two awards. One uh, in the past few years, uh, which is a NCA doctoral award for an outstanding doctoral thesis. Um, and that, the information about that is on the NCA website, so that's available to you to think about students that you perhaps have supervised that may be deserving of some wider international recognition. And then there's a new award that I'm happy to announce at this conference for the first time, and that is the NCA Award for Excellence in Research in Education Through Art. And the details about that are also on the website, but essentially this is an award which will be awarded biannually at each uh, in between the World Congress. So this one will be awarded in Helsinki in 2018, uh, and it recognizes outstanding research contributions, so it's not necessarily an individual award, but maybe a group award. Uh, so that's really all I want to say. Five awards now available. Well, it's my turn now to speak to you as uh, the present president of uh, European Regional Council of INSEA. And uh, I want to invite everyone here who comes from Europe to join this European Regional Council. Um, first of all, I want to mention we will have a meeting tomorrow. Uh, maybe you have uh, seen it on the schedule. It is tomorrow at 12.15 in Hörsaal 2 at the Angewandte, so the other place uh, where we have to go. It is a meeting of the European Regional Council of INSEA. As you may know, INSEA is not divided, but consists of several parts uh, belonging to the continents. And uh, this European Regional Council is a meeting we have at uh, any um, conference of INSEA in order to exchange information of the national organizations, of uh, political aspects uh, of our uh, subject, of exchanging information about research projects or collaboration projects. So you are hardly invited to come tomorrow at 12.15 to Hörsaal 2 to join our meeting of the European Regional Council in order to exchange information with us here, what is going on in the places in Europe concerning art education. We have uh, some interesting information of uh, local activities and you can meet people probably to, uh, to, to make acquaintance to them and to exchange um, cooperation plans, whatever. And thank you very much on behalf of the European Regional Council to the organizers of this conference. Uh, Ruth, Luisa and Clelia, uh, we had many exchange of emails in the recent weeks and I got the impression that it is really a marvelous organization team. You had so many ideas and you had so many things in mind and even today I get the impression it seems to be well organized but we will see what will happen, <laughs> it's not yet finished. <laughs> But thank you very much for preparing this, uh, this Congress and you did it very quickly. I think the plan arised uh, last year and it was one year to prepare it. It's not usual to succeed in such a, a short time to prepare such a conference. So thank you again very much for doing this for us. And I'm not yet ready because there will be another European conference in two years. Next year we will meet in Korea but 2018 we will meet in Finland and there is an information poster at the end of this room you can find first informations and flyers about the European Regional Congress in Helsinki in 2018 but now we are happy to enjoy our meeting in Vienna So, this is the INSEAD team, and uh, well, before we start the conference, I want to congratulate all the art teachers in Austria, because I heard that the Art Teacher Association will have 60 years uh, of life next week. They will celebrate theirs. It's one of the eldest organizations in Europe, so congratulations. And let's start our conference. Let's do it. <laughs> 